What's up guys, it's Dragonfly Mike 77 Today I'm going to be reviewing Coconara Lemon Mint. <laughs> Alright, I've reviewed a couple Coconara, so I'm gonna do this how I do my normal reviews and start talking about the flavor first. I'm assuming that it's a lemon mint flavor. On the package you get a lemon and some mint leaves. Not sure if you can see that. And let me pop into some clouds. Again, as I've stated before, I just don't think the clouds on the coconut tobacco are as developed as I'm used to. I just feel like they're not as billowy and, and big as some of the other brands out there. So when it comes to the flavor, on the inhale, definitely get that minty cooling effect on the inhale. It's not as strong as some of the other ones, but it's definitely there. On the exhale is when you really start to pick up the flavors. And the mint actually kind of settles on the back of your tongue and stays there for a little bit. And the mint I get is kind of like a peppermint. When it comes to the lemon, the lemon isn't too strong in this. A lot of times with lemon mint flavors, I never feel like the lemon is strong enough. And I'm starting to wonder if that's because if you add the lemon, if, if you make the lemon a little too strong, you might kind of get like a pine salt taste to it. I'm not sure if that's true, but I would like the lemon to be stepped up a little more. What I do like about this lemon mint is it's a little sweeter than some of the other ones. So even though I'm not real big on the mint flavors, I kind of am... I'm alright with it because it's a little sweeter. That lemon is sweet in it, so it kind of gives it a little more of a uh, different characteristics than some of the other flavors out there. But since this is a mint flavor, I'm still not real big on that. because So the rating is only a 14 out of 20. It's not a bad rating, but it's still something that I'm not too keen on. When it comes to the longevity, I do think the longevity is good on this, but that lemon on the second round of coals really drops off and I'm left with more of a, a peppermint type flavor to it, and that's kind of a bummer. I like the fact that that lemon is a little sweet, and when that dies down, it it just kind of changes it up for me, and I notice as the session goes on, I'm, I'm not real big on the flavor as much. Because of that, I'm dropping it down to a 14 out of 20, same as the flavor. It's not bad. Definitely not the worst that I've had, but I just feel like that lemon, I'd like to see that lemon step up a little more. Let me take another poke for you guys. Do I want to smoke this? This is one of those yes and no's. Uh, it's a little warmer today, and I don't like having my AC on constantly because I don't like having my TV too loud since I've got people above me and below me. So when it's days like this, I actually kind of enjoy smoking the lemon mint or mint-like flavors because it's cooling, and especially if you add a little ice to the base, it really does kind of like cool you down a little bit, and I like that. But overall, this isn't something that I'm sitting there and I'm like, this is what I'm going to smoke. It's not something that I'm really going to have in my, in my stash on a regular basis. I'll order it from time to time when I, during the summer. This is definitely something that I could potentially see myself ordering again. Because of that, it's a 14 out of 20. Again, it's not the worst and it's not the best I've had. It's kind of like a middle rating for me. I'll take one more poke before I talk about the consistency and the appearance. This is smoking really well right now. I'm not a big fan of the coals I have. I used to really like them, the Cocoa Ultimates, but lately they, uh, they've they been giving me a headache for some reason, and, and I'm not sure why. When it comes to the consistency, as you can see, it's choppy. This one is actually, it seems like it was a little wetter and uh, stickier than some of the other Coconars that I've had, but I still feel like the clouds, for some reason the clouds just aren't 
aren't there. So because of that, my consistency is a 17 out of 20. I like the consistency, but I just feel like maybe if they changed it up a little bit, maybe the cloud transfer would be a little better. When it comes to the appearance, as I said before, I like the containers. I can reuse these, which is a big bonus. Uh, I just want a little more pizzazz with them, something where it kind of sticks out and you go, okay, that's coconut, and maybe add a little more color than the white. But I still like the, the, the uh, containers, so it's an 18 out of 20. A grand total for this flavor is a 77 out of 100. It's a flavor that I do enjoy, but not something that I'm real big on. On my old scale, it's an, in the middle. It's it's not bad, but it's, there are some things I'd like to see stepped up a little more. I know I said one more poke, but I'm going to take another one because it's smoking good. I think that's all I got. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, guys, peace out.